Hi everyone, welcome back. I have a collective beauty supply haul, makeup of course, but from a drugstore, EB, and yeah, let's get started because I am super, super elated to show you some of this stuff because I have been waiting for these forever and despite I'm doing project pan, I'm definitely going to add these goodies into my next basket but I don't want to continue rambling let's get on with the haul let's start with the products that I got off of eBay so these brushes were 99 cents I was I was like so excited when I saw it got so excited to get it and then when I got it the barrels are off so not a big squeal about it because I have Obi classes crazy glue um, Gorilla Glue also so these bad boys are just gonna get all fixed up and then we're good to go but 99 cents I was elated so this is like the wrong dome one I think they're both the same are they the same no this one is a little more dense this one is wide I think it's more dense but I love these if you guys only know what happened I don't like washing these like I have about 12 of them right now because I bought two sets um, I have 12 of those to wash and I've been putting it off Ugh, I absolutely hate that then I got this it's like a marker dupe to do 168 which is an angle contour I have a, a MAC 1 and this is very close to it but a MAC 1 is about this bigger so that's the difference but I actually like this because this you can actually get more in depth contouring or if you like to contour your nose for those of you contour your nose this is perfect the quality actually feels really good doesn't feel very light doesn't feel heavy feels almost authentic mark so this is really nice um, feels very steady and well made I paid $1.99 for this um, to me I can see this as highlighter and all of that I'm very elated with this and I think I'm going to go to eBay and pick up a couple more for myself and I haven't shown any friends as yet it's because I sure if I show them they will go crazy then from um, the beauty group that I belong where people were um, swapping makeup and also selling, I decided to purchase these um, these two What's a Wild lipstick. They came in a bundle with some other stuff that one of my girlfriends got. So she initially wanted, they had a bundle of Wet n Wild stuff and the person was doing it like $10 shipped. And it had like about six wet and wild lipsticks and I think some of the trios and a six a five pan or something that was a really amazing deal. I just wanted these two lipsticks. So my friend ordered a bundle and when she checked it up, she's like, Ron, I'm gonna give you the two lipsticks that you wanted. No need to pay for it. In her order, that is the same friend I I bundled up with for the Jordana haul. So this is Urban Nights and I really wanted this because this came out um, in a collection of course I didn't get on that bandwagon and it's what I'm wearing I don't know what you guys think I'm I'm not a vampy person of course it came perfect and I threw it down jacked it up the package all kind of stuff like really crazy I took it and I had it and it fell on the ground and I picked it up put it back on my table and it fell on the ground again typical Rowan and this is 906D wine room which my friend did not like when she's watching she's like Rowan it does look masala ish <laughs> so uh, she gave it to me and I was excited because I just wanted wine room and then I was like I loved how this looks watched on my hand have not put it on my lips but I am still excited so oh my god if you know how much lippies I have gotten for the last couple so I and I already had so much um I already had so much what you call these things the bees they were like the most I have in my collection so then I got a couple stuff from Black Radiance this would be this brown tongue downtown browns I really wanted this has have um jungle jungle something jungle somebody I don't know it has a green in it anywho these are super gorgeous and so I am happy to get this very brown and neutral want to do a review that's why I got that and in addition I got these pigments 
these are the black radiance continuous color pigments so I got bronze which looks like this I have no idea about these things do you guys mind if I open I mean like it's going to, it is going to be longer but do you guys mind like you not I know some of you might be answering like no Rana your video is already so long but I want to at least watch one of these oh my goodness I'm using a butter knife and it's crazy up to open like crazy packaging oh of course these are from Marquins which is the same brand as Wet and Wild okay this was a task I had nails I would have definitely broken one so this is bronze and please don't tell me that they don't have the name oh, my goodness there's no name here that says bronze oh my gosh black radiance why do you do this but the lapis is the same thing so this is bronze this is what it looks like it has a sift or something here please tell me there is oh no just made a mess there is no sifter you just have a lid that's crazy and then mm, Man, I like that swatch. So of course I have a whole bunch of mess here. So we're gonna swatch. Ah, let's use this wipe and wipe everything and just get a clean swatch. I should have been a little more prepared. What you guys think, huh? But no, I am not that prepared. But I had no intentions, people, of actually showing you guys the swatches for this. Just because I knew it was a lot and I just had intention. So this is how it is. I just had intention of showing you guys and then doing swatches later. So this is bronze. Very shimmery. Reminds me a lot. This one in particular reminds me a lot of Elf. Um, of the Elf pigments. Mineral pigments thing. So that's bronze. The other two that I got, this is gold, which looks like an old gold kind of color. I'll save you guys the drama. And this one is called orange. I couldn't resist the orange, so that's orange. So I will do a whole review kind of thing. Oh my goodness. If you see my lap here. Ugh. Then the other part that I got um, was from Hard Candy. And this is a new foundation. It's called um, Glam Glamouflage Invisible Camouflage Foundation. I got medium tan, and this girl, Love Heather, did a review. She said that it was really light. All right, here we go. This I it's new. Okay, so that's medium tan, and guess what? It's looking like it's a bit light for me. Okay. So medium tan and this was what the second to last in terms of um, darkness so but those of you who are like darker than me I don't think you can use this foundation I will maybe try and get the darkest one but this one looks like it's lighter than me but I will try it out I'll let you know so this is foundation number four that I have yeah last two items were these NYC smooch Proof, smooch proof, um, smooch proof lip, lippies. Now I hope that the colors are on, are on them, and the, not on the people, because I am like tearing crazy away. This one says what? Uh, unforgettable fuchsia. Please tell me. The name is here because I will have to create labels for that black radiant stuff. Okay, here we go. It's another one without a name on it. So this is... Was it? Unforgettable Fuchsia. So I will definitely have to check these blogs for this. So this is what it looks like. Lip stain again. Ooh, one swipe. I will let you guys know how this goes. What this one is now. I can't see the name. On everyone's lips. So this one is called on everyone's lips. Mm -hmm. Again, I should have done these this before. 
I'll be back. Some months later, here I am with tiny pieces. That one came off in a bunch of tiny pieces. Oh my gosh, can you imagine how <sighs> patience, God is teaching me patience. This is on everyone's lips. Ooh. That looks nice and nudie. Oh wow. I will definitely let you guys know how these work. So these are called smooch proof on everyone's lips and unforgettable fuchsia. These were very inexpensive. I think they were like $2.49 each. Black Radiance, I think, were like $2.49 also. This foundation from Hot Candy Do is $7. So that's I find it's more than my um, Maybelline Fit Me, which I am absolutely loving these days. And the Giordano one, I don't know if it's going to work for me, but that is, um, what you call it? That is, the Giordano was like four or five dollars. <gasps> Can you guys see this? Watch. It's stained just that little time. Oh my goodness. It's stained, especially that fuchsia one. <gasps> oh wow. That. Hours later, this thing is still on. Can you imagine what's gonna happen when it goes on your lips? Mm hmm. Yes, a review will be coming. Not months later. Just give me a couple of days and I'll get it out to you guys. So, that is my random crazy haul. And I will let me guys know if you guys don't mind me being unprepared. Who likes anybody unprepared? Forget it. I am going to come better to you guys, but I just wanted to get these out to you all and a lot is going on, but I'm happy to be playing with my makeup because that makes me happy. Let me know how you guys are doing and what's up on your end. Love to hear from you all. So until next time.